Hey y'all, welcome to the JL Ranch in a beautiful, I mean, beautiful afternoon. I haven't had a lot of time to be out here lately, but today, today, work is done and I am on the path. So, we're gonna talk a little bit about what's gonna happen with this truck, but before we do, I noticed some things in the pasture whenever we first pulled up that I have to go inspect and you're coming along. Come on, put your face in the sunshine. Let's go for a walk. I got my most best help here with me today. That's right, Ritzy is the only one who got to ride to the JL Ranch today. And she was so excited. I noticed that Grandpa and Daisy and Duke are up here too. So this is this is a beautiful day. So current state, there's the cows. Uh, current state, this is our hay field. It may evolve to be something else in the very near future. But what I noticed was number one, the grass is long and beautiful. Like, Lester mowed here about a week ago. But look at the difference. Crazy, crazy tall. Even their grass is still pretty tall. Hi, Sadie! Hi, beautiful! She's out protecting cows, doing her job. Duck, baby, duck! Her poor little tail has experienced a lot of that barbed wire. Hi, baby. How are you? Come to go for a walk with mom. No, 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 no. Come to go for a walk with mom. Ritzy's here too, okay? See her? You so excited to have company? Oh, boy. She's like, hey, Ritzy. Ritzy's like, hey, Sadie. Good to see you. So good to see you. Let's play. Be sweet. Hang on. Sadie, you still smell like skunk, baby. I don't mean to be mean. Aw. That old lady can still play, can't she? All right, let's go for a walk. Come on. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> Ritzy's like, please don't hurt me. You're really big. You're really big. Sadie's like, you're not big enough to play like real play with. But it's good to have company. You got briars in your hair, sweetie. Oh, you still smell like skunk. Okay. So out in this field is a multitude of wildflowers. Oh, careful, that was too rough, Sadie. That was too rough. Don't get me wrong, I'm terrified we're gonna be in Snakeville. Lester says we're not because, because there's no water source up here, but I'm up to my knees. I'm up to my knees in some grass here, baby. Now, a lot of people have been messaging Lester about the thistle, and we'll talk about that, but for now, we're gonna talk about the fact that I'm pretty sure, hi sweetie, I'm pretty sure that, hey, I'm making a video of flowers, not just Sadie. I'm pretty sure that I have these exact things growing in a flower pot right next to the door at Longhorn Lester's. Sadie's like, what are you eating? What could you possibly be eating? Ricky's like, I'm just chewing on a little grass, you know, getting a feel for J and L. These are berries, I do believe, growing up in here. But these, this is what I'm talking about. I feel like I have, Sadie, I feel like I have a few, a few of those planted. This is thistle. And everybody says there's nothing that will kill it. You got to dig it up. We're, we're going to do some further education on that. I'm going to look on Texas A&M website see what it says because if we got to come out here and dig up every five foot that's not cool I wish my grandpa was alive to still ask him because he really was a incredible farmer and would know those things I don't want to dig up uh, every five foot I don't now this field has been fertilized I'm telling you this is this is pretty deep all throughout. There are spots where it's so tall that it's folding over, which is 
crazy. This, this right here, this is above my knees. That's awesome. I want to bring the horses out here for a play day so, so bad. But that's weird to want to like pack up your horses and bring them somewhere with you. Ooh, look at these pretty things, Sadie. No, no, come on. I didn't, I didn't. <laughs> Baby. <laughs> Sweetie. I love you so much, but you smell so bad. You smell so bad. Okay, let's see if she'll let me flip this camera around to keep looking. These are different. These have hangy things. They look like like honeysuckle tubes almost, except for that's not honeysuckle that I'm aware of. I've never seen those before. The yellows are everywhere. You can see as you look out through here, we have a mix of yellow and purple. Ooh, here's a crimson and clover. Do you see it yet? One lonely little red, well two. Two little red sprouts out here in the middle. Here's a bigger thistle. This is, they do get big. And that was the cotton thing that I picked last year whenever we were walking through here. It's really pretty. Looks pokey. That's pokey, Sadie, it's pokey. Ritzy left us. She went on the other side to go inspect poles. She's doing fence checks while Sadie and I are doing flower outlook. Ooh, that's gonna be a berry right there. No other berries that I see just yet. I would be surprised if I actually get berries out of anything. Feels more like, wow. That really is beautiful. You have to admit, that's really pretty. Don't, it's pokey. She's like, don't worry, mama. I got plenty of armor. Don't worry, mama. I gotta bring my thinning shears out here and thin Sadie down. Let's see what else we got going on out here. I wish there were cattails around the pond. I haven't made my way out to the pond since the alligator sighting. Pretty nervous about that. Don't really want to hang out with an alligator. What about you, Sadie? She's like, I don't, I don't hang out with the alligator. Haven't seen it, mom. Well, I don't want to see it. I don't want to interact with it. Not a fan. Of alligators. In fact, one of my biggest fears. Ooh, these are different yellows. Very different. What do you think about them, Sadie? You look beautiful out here. She's like, yeah, but did you bring lunch? No, baby. You had breakfast already. You can't have breakfast, lunch, and dinner. You're a dog. She's like, but I work so hard, mama. Here's another different kind of yellow flower. Pretty, don't know what you are. I'm sure somebody in the comments is gonna tell me. There are more, ooh, there's a big thistle over here. Super biggest one out here. I would love if this was blue bonnet. Oh, what are you? Hold on, hold the phones here, Sadie. What is that? She's like, I don't know, but it's another opportunity for you to pet me. Look at this monster. Serious monster. So what people do is they chop off the sides and they eat the stalk. They peel it and they eat the stalk and they say it tastes like broccoli. This is a behemoth. Oh, you have bugs in you. You have, this is weird. I think those are squash bugs. Interesting. Full of them. That's soft. Oh, look at you. I expected that to be prickly too. Huh. Okay. Let's keep going. There were some prettier things up front. That's why I'm walking all the way up here. It is absolutely deep out here. And hopefully we can figure out how to get all the weeds out of it and 
make some good hay one day, Sadie. We shall see though. There's another good old thistle. Yeah, there's a lot of thistle out here. Look at you, pretty. You know what's really weird to me? There's no dandelions. Are dandelions not a thing in Texas? Oh my gosh, these, I don't know what these are called, but I had this at my house in Illinois that my mom planted from the lady next door. I don't know what those are called, but they grow wild here. Yeah, no dandelions that I've ever seen in Texas. And in Illinois, everybody strives to get rid of dandelions, but do you know the medicinal properties in dandelion? It's unbelievable the uses for that. And even crazier that there's so much, so much desire to get rid of them. I'm sure that's probably by design. I am in a berry patch right now. There, you can't tell it, but as I'm walking through, my ankles are being sliced up by stickers and thorns from the berries. Here's something else different. I wonder what that is. It looks like it's gonna be beautiful. I will have to get out my plant app and figure out what some of these are, because that's what most of y'all are gonna tell me. If you had a plant app, I do have one, but I'm making a video and showing y'all because it's a, a fun walk, right Sadie? Now this grass is different. It has like reeds on it. Very different. This looks like Bahia to me. That's what it does at, at Plum Grove in the hay field. And then when this, this is like the seed pods, I could be wrong. We call that Texas tumbleweed when it grows and breaks off and reseeds itself. That's what that looks like right there, is Bahia. I could be wrong. And I didn't know what Bahia was before I came to Texas, for the record. Never even heard that word before. Aren't those pretty? I think they are. That might be the extent of our types of wildflowers. Here's some that we haven't seen yet. Look at that wildflower. Look at that pretty wildflower. She doesn't smell like a wildflower, I'll tell you that. That's dad, baby. She's like, we don't actually come up this far. We don't, baby. But you can come with me. It's dad. It's okay. Very perplexed right now. <laughs> it's okay, Sadie. Lester is doing a super fun project today. I want to go to this corner up here and see the angle of it. Oh, she realized it's dad now. She was nervous at first. I love how cautious she is and how protective that she is as well. These are different too. Look at these little yellow dudes. So I've seen three, four different kinds of yellow flowers, but these are like little balls, almost look like pineapples. <laughs> really is a pretty day here. See what I'm talking about up here in this corner? Okay, so this one might be my favorite one so far. If I move my That's a cool shot, y'all. You know, before I met Lester, pictures were my thing. I loved, loved to come take pictures of things. Now I take videos and try to show the same perspective I would in a picture, but maybe I'm showing you how to see it in a video. Here's a bunch of those. 
Now the only thing that would make this better is if there would be a bee would land on this or if Sadie would come running up from the back. Yep. Ah, Sadie's not running up anywhere. She is taking a break with her daddy. She left me. I'm not surprised. Ritzy also left me. I'm a lone ranger out here all by myself, a lone wolf. It's okay. It was a good walk, y'all. Oh, Ritzy's at the pond. Rolling. She found a good spot, I guess. <laughs> Oh no, he set off the alarm and ruined the whole video. 